Thank you for the very nice presentation, introduction, and thank you all for being here today. Um, yes. So uh, I will uh, talk a bit about model execution, something that, uh, that I've been working on since I was a PhD student. So now they've, uh, they've, they've passed some years, so I've seen some things, worked with, with the, um, several uh, people. Some, uh, some of these people are in the room, uh, in some companies. Uh, so Ericsson, Volvo, uh, Saab, and some smaller ones. So we have been doing a lot of things when it comes to, to, uh, to model execution, uh, both for simulation purposes, but also for, for I mean, real execution on the, on the actual platforms. So I will start uh, uh, with the, the very basics so that uh, you, you have a clear idea on, on, on what I will be talking about, especially when it comes to the, to the basic concepts. So models, we have models everywhere uh, of all kinds. Uh, when I talk about models here, I mean um, this kind of stuff, so software models. Um, so as you know, models can be found in any uh, scientific discipline, and we need to be quite precise when we actually uh, talk about models. So what do, what do we talk about? What do we mean? So a generic definition of a model is that it is an abstract representation of a specific part, problem, solution, or feature of a specific domain. So something that actually represents a part of the reality. Then there are several definitions of what the software model is. Now, I won't go through them, but there are very many of them. So I just picked four, four of them uh, and put them here. Um, when I talk about software model and in general the model in this, I mean today in this talk, I will mean a, a blueprint of a software application, something that can be itself executable and that is directly usable for automating the development process of software. When I say model execution, I mean a process of partly or fully running a computational model, so a model that can be executed in a software environment. Uh, this can be done for different purposes, for instance, for simulation, uh, both for prediction and moni monitoring of a system based on specific inputs and configurations, and in general, model execution is very important to understand the complex systems, both to understand but also to, to manage complex systems. And it is very important also to, to, for forecasting outcomes related to uh, critical uh, aspects uh, that many systems have, such as time, safety, security, and so on. Model execution, I consider it essential in several domains. Uh, here I mention a few that are quite